guys, so today I just have a fast little tip to share with you guys. And I just filmed a different video, so that's why I have like the same hair and outfit and everything. So if you guys are like, you wore that already, that's why. And also I kind of have like a few other little tips and stuff that I want to share with you guys. Just fast little things about all different categories and stuff. But I'm kind of trying to think of like a category for this. Because I know if you guys have seen my videos, you kind of know that I have like different categories for like every video and stuff. So I'm kind of trying to think of like a cute name to name these things. So if you guys have any ideas, please leave them below. But let's just get started and I'll tell you guys what I have to say. So if you guys have like the Maybelline color tattoos, you know that they kind of tend to dry out sort of fast if you don't use them every day. And this is my one in Bad to the Bronze, which I don't wear as often as the other one just because it's a little bit darker. And I reached for it the other day and I noticed that mine had dried out. And I was really irritated because I was like, well, I don't want to buy a new one and... So I was sitting there at like my makeup area and I was like, I don't know what to do. And I looked over and I saw these All May Eye Makeup Remover Circle things. And I was like, I bet that would fit like inside the cap. And so sure enough, I set it on top of the jar and twisted the jar back on and it fit perfectly. And I left it like that for a few days. And then when I took it off, this is completely fine again. Like it's not completely back to normal, but the top layer is moist enough to use it again so yeah all I did was put this um, right straight on it and then close it up I'll probably have a picture and picture of me doing it up close like playing this whole time so you guys know what I'm talking about I figured I would go ahead and share this with you guys just because I have heard a few other beauty gurus say that they've had to buy brand new ones of these just because they've dried out but I think you guys should definitely try just sticking one of these in the cap because then when like because then the air will pull the moisture out of the pad instead of the actual product. And the wetness of the product will actually kind of keep the top layer of this wet as well. I would just replace it whenever it gets dry. That's what I plan on doing. So yeah, I hope you guys found this helpful. Um, if you give it a try, let me know if yours works out too. I didn't see this anywhere or anything. I just totally randomly thought of it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And please subscribe if you haven't already. And of course, like this video if you liked it. I love you guys so much and I'll talk to you later. Bye.